Coach Schnellberger back then had the pipe in his hand, scared the hell out of me, actually still does. We used to be in the locker room. Over the wall, it was an opening. You can smell the cherry pipe smell. That was his flavor, cherry. And guys would start whispering, hey, uh, Coach Schnellberger coming. It became dead silent in the locker room. When he appears, everybody stops. And when he speaks, everybody listen. How you doing, gentlemen? Everybody in unison. Hey, Coach, how you doing? And it's a gentleman. And then as soon as the door closes, as he goes out, everything goes back to normal. I think he did it intentionally to really intimidate us. Even to the last day when I played as a University of Miami Hurricane, he came out on the field. I was just sitting there. He looked down and he said, hey, Arthur, how are you doing? You know, in that baritone voice he has. And I remember the, what hair I had left was uh, standing up, man. That's how much of an intimidating person he was. That's just the presence he had. And everybody respected and loved him. There isn't anything he couldn't do or say that I wouldn't do. I mean, one out of respect and maybe two out of fear and not necessarily in that order.